in the previous video we discussed and logic gate nand logic gate we will discuss xor and not logic gates this is the xor exclusive or logic gate okay the xor logic gate is having two inputs and one output this is how it is represented in the software the equivalent circuit is series circuit with two change over contacts the output of xor logic gate is on only when both the inputs are having different states 0 1 or 1 0 okay then only the output is high the output is on if the inputs are having same status 0 0 1 1 then the output is off if there is an unused input is there then it will consider as zero logic zero by the software so this is the logic table with two inputs input one input two and one output q go to software take two inputs and one output go to basic functions take xor now join them Add comments. Okay. Open the PLC, give it the download. So go to tools, transfer, select PC to logo. Select IP, click OK. The program is downloading. Go to online mode, click the PLC icon. Select IP. Click OK so that we can see the status in the software also. Done. Our input 1 is normally open contact, input 2 is normally closed contact. So the present input is I1 status is 0, I2 status is 1. See in the software, in the program, I1 is blue color, I2 is red color, means it is 0, the second one is 1. Both are having different inputs. That is why the XR output is on. Just press the input 2. That means we are making it to off. I1 is off, I2 is off. Then the XR output is off. The XR logic gate, if both the inputs are same state, then the output is off. Now both the inputs are 0, 0, same status, same state. That's why the output is off. Release input 2 and press input 1. Okay, I'm pressing the input 1. That means the input 1 is on and input 2 is on, right? The XR logic gate, if they're having same input status, then the output is off. Either the input is on or off. If both the inputs are the same state, then the output is off. If both the inputs have in different state, then output is on. So this is the XOR logic gate. Okay. Now we will check the NOT gate. Okay. So click the arrow. 
take one more input. And take one output. Take one NOT gate. So this one is the NOT gate. Okay. The NOT gate is represented by the block with the one and the output one bubble is there, right? So this is the NOT. So download it to the PLC. You can directly click on this icon PC to logo. It will download the program. Click yes. Yes. So that's it. What the not get will do? It will inverse the input status. Okay. If the input is one, the output will be zero. If the input is zero, the output will be one. Okay. What is the equivalent circuit? If you see, so this is the equivalent circuit. One break contact. Okay. One normally closed contact. Okay. So we will test the logic. We are using input 3 and uh, output 2 for the NOT gate, right? Input 3 right now is on. That is why output 2 is off. Make input 3 off. Output 2 is on. It will just inverse. You can also use the online test mode. Click on the PLC. Tell the IP. Click OK. Now we are in online. See the input I3 is off. It is in blue color. The output Q2 is on. Okay. Make the input I3. On. Input I3 is now on. And output is off. So this is the. Not gate. Okay, very simple. Not gate is having only one input and one output. I will meet you in the next video. Thank you.